Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Now today I'm going to be reviewing this hair that was sent to me by Ultra. The name of this hair is called Dominican Straight and it's in 20 inches, so stay tuned. Now today I'm going to be reviewing this hair that was sent to me by Ultra. This is the Ultra My Tresses Leave Out Wig, well it's the U Part Wig. And this is the style, what is this one? This is the Dominican Blowout, I think it is. Yeah. But guys, look at this box. The box is like so cute and nice. This is the, yeah, so this is the human hair Dominican straight, and then I got it in 20 inches long. So let's take it out. So I got the color, this is the color natural black. I'll read you the stock card afterwards and tell you all the other colors they have. Now this is the same thing as the other one that I um, had received from Ultra. This is the little band thingy that they have that they just send it in the packaging like that. So you're gonna cut those off, both sides. All right, this is what the wig is looking like. Probably gonna go in and like curl the ends of this and stuff, but I got it. This is very nice though. Okay. okay. So guys, don't judge my braids. It's a bit rough. Okay. So I have to find out the last time I did my part in the middle, I kinda wanna do it on the side this time, but let me kinda just measure first and see what I'm gonna do. Now, this is the same um setup as far as the the clips, they have these type of clippy thingies. I forgot what you call these, the, the name of these, but um, then they have the ones on the side and then the one for the nape. And then of course the, the um, adjustable straps to fit it to the size of your head. So this is my original middle part that I have from whenever. I'm gonna take this, which one am I gonna take? I'm gonna take out this one and um, just leave out my section. Now, with my texture here, the 4C here, it's like super hard to kind of blend with these U parts. As you guys, if you guys watched my last video, I had a really hard time trying to blend with the, um, the curly hair, but I have my, what do you call this thingy? A hot comb, so I'm gonna try to see if I can maybe straighten out my hair a little bit. I don't know, but this wig looks super, super nice. Guys, my hair might look a little bit dirty, but I've been using that, what is that thingy, that Indian hemp thingy or with the little particle thingies in it, so that's probably why it looks like a little dry or, not dry, but you might see a little particles in it or whatever. Anyway, let's continue. I'm just gonna break this section down. My hair feels very moisturized though. I like it. Alright, that's done. I'm gonna braid this. Go in here. I just wanna put the wig on first. So this is my leave out here. Just make sure my part. I'm not gonna see that anyway, because that's gonna be on the other end, that's gonna be another camera. I'm hoping this works. As far as me blending. All right, so I'm gonna hook that there. Hook that there. Then I'm gonna hook that there. Now these clip thingies are easier than it looks. Cause I be, I be doing too much when I'm trying to close these. All right, and then now let's hook this one in. It doesn't get up. All right, guys, I gotta take this braid out and braid that one piece closer. Because since the braids are so big, it's like going too far down. This one, I'm just gonna do this a little smaller, mainly because I want the clip to hook closer to the, the top of my arm. Um, my leave out.
And then I'm just gonna lay this one back too. Alright, let's see. So now, yeah, okay, I think we're good. But it's still puckering. Alright, let me see. Let's pull that down. So I need this to be flat. Now it's time to blend this. Let's see. So this is a hot comb. So I'm gonna try to see if I can straighten out my natural hair. Let's see. Cause I need to get this. I don't know. Just don't blend. It's a rock. I don't know what I'm gonna do. So I have this on number one. I'm gonna put it up to number two because I just don't want too much heat on my hair, which at this point I don't think it really matters, but it can be so it can blend in with this. I don't know. If I had a perm, it'd be good to go. All right, guys. So that hot comb is not blending out this this um part for me. So I'm gonna go in and see if my flat iron is gonna work. Now, once I could get this to blend, like this is like super cute. It's just this is my issue with these U part U part wigs as far as my texture here. Like the 4C here is like I don't know what to do. Wait a minute, wait a minute. All right, we're gonna do that one again, but we're gonna do it down. So guys, I'm still blending with this um, flat iron. I'm just trying to get it as best as I can with the, um, my texture here. But I think for the most part, it came out pretty decent with this flat iron. I'm gonna go in with some um, more of this argan oil. Just a little bit, just like a dab. This stuff is very greasy, just to put it on my texture here. Alright, so this is the finished look of me installing this Dominican straight wig, the U-part wig. I think it came out pretty nice as far as I don't know if you guys saw in the beginning how I was trying to blend my hair my 4c hair like I tried everything I tried the hot comb and I tried it for a while and that was like not working so then I went in with the 
my hot um my flat iron as you guys saw and that pretty much blended out the part as best it could as it could be for me having natural hair with this kind of blown out texture here and i think it re really looks really nice like i love the texture of the hair it's like super duper soft like oh like i just went and got a blowout it's super nice and super cute but we're going to get into the stock card now this is the stock card that they send with, along with the hair and it says it has nine plus quality grade bundle hair you can bleach the hair it says it says bleach and dye customize also it says the cap i don't know if you guys saw to get in the inside of the cap it says it's bacteria resistant as far as the colors they have they have the natural color which is what i'm wearing right now they have a brown they have chestnut brown and then they have honey golden brown so it says my tresses gold leave out wig is like a sew in weave but better exactly so this reminds me like back in the day i used to do i used to do like a lot of sewing sew-ins in my hair like sew-ins with the weaves and stuff like with the needle and thread and stuff like that and that takes too long so this is like perfect as far as like um time i should say because all you're really doing is just keeping your hair straight back and then just clipping in like the two clips in the front the one in the back and then the comb in the back as well the only issue i had with this wig was as far as me just blending blending my natural hair with the texture of this hair but i think it looks really really amazing guys like this is just like a natural like just a blowout like i went to go get my hair blown out it looks really really nice this hair is 100 percent unprocessed human hair it reveals your own part for a natural look as you guys can see with my part i left that a little bit right there um it has the narrow u part opening for less leave out it's shiftable you can part it anywhere you can also part it in the middle right here which i'm not going to do because then i have to go out and blend that but guys you can put it in the middle you can put it on the side um the clips and cones are there for security and it has a nice soft natural luster which i explained to you guys as far as the hair all right guys so i hope you guys like this review on the ultra dominican straight 20 inch U part wig that was sent to me by Ultra. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, hit the notification bell so you won't miss another video, and stay tuned for more.